do to what it do, man. It is your boy, Abdullah Next, and I'm back with another video today, man. Yes, Sershki, man. Hey, am I even Abdullah Up Next anymore? I got the cape today. I can fly. I can fly. Hold up, watch this. Yay! Now, I know what y'all are thinking. Abdul, why is your cape a rainbow? All right, look. I like having fun with these intros. I was at the store, and all they had was the rainbow cape. This shit kind of cool, don't you think? I can tell a motherfucker you got it. Go, hold up, watch this. You gotta go. <laughs> it's a it's a beautiful Saturday. This is being recorded. I'm fresh off of consistency. How do y'all like consistent dually? In the comment section right now, tell me. Do you love me? Do you love me? If I'm not loved, I'm not coming back. I'll disappear right now. You know, I got the cape on. And I'll disappear right now. They always ask me if I ever had a chance to be a super, if I ever had a chance to have a superpower, what would I choose? You already know I want invisibility. I can do anything. I can rob you. I can spy on you. Billie Eilish. If I get invisibility, I'll probably be in jail in 12 seconds, man. I ain't gonna lie, Billy. I'm gonna have you whether you like it or not. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, 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 hey. I got another thing to tell y'all. I made it to the sleepover. I got a sleepover to go to today. Yeah, all that twerking in the videos paid off, nigga. I'm going to the sleepover with the shorties today. Not one shorty, not two shorty, not five shorty. I made it to the girl sleepover. I'm the only boy in that bitch. They gonna be real mad when I tell them I'm not gay. I'm just gonna be honest, I, I was lying. But I'm going today. I made it, I did that shit. It's worth it, man. I'm gonna tell y'all if it's worth it after the sleepover. Point of the video today, we are watching the worst TikToks ever made. Now, I don't know what does this mean. I don't know what it means at all. You're just gonna have to find out. Three, two, one. We are just gonna watch this worst TikToks ever video. I don't know what to expect, but we just gonna see, you know what I'm saying? Hey, if y'all like when I react to TikToks, I, I like it, bro. Every time I tell y'all I need a part two, do y'all know what y'all do? Y'all exceed what I asked for. I think I gotta start blue balling y'all. Y'all, y'all like to get teased. I, I caught you. You, I caught you. Every time I ask you for a light go, what you do? You hit that like button. When I don't ask you for a light go, why don't you just hit it anyways? Did you realize that? You only hit the like button when I ask you for a light go. So if this video is lit, I hope you know what I'm gonna tell you to do at the end of this video. Let's go. Guys, don't you wanna high five me? <laughs> Hey, bro, just like me, if I'm being honest. Just gonna be honest. You get in public and I don't know you and you're doing some shit like this, I'm gonna run. You're scaring. I'm gonna run. People who do shit like this in public actually scare me. I was walking into Party City to get my little flag and, and what blew me? Like, niggas was doing that. I seen a dude running outside screaming and yelling. I'm like, bro, you look like you 16. How you already on crack? Crackheads scare me, bruh. They be asking me for money. I'm so I'm scared to talk to you. I can't give you money, bro. You look like you're gonna bite my finger off. Buy me. <laughs> what does Y E S spell? Y E S? Yeah. Y E S. I don't know. What? What is oh too much going on? Man, how you don't know what Y E S spells? East? Spells it spells East. Oh, TikTok. An app that is allowing us to consume more media than ever before in all of human history, and for some reason, we seem to not be- I'm gonna click this video to see TikToks. Why I got a duck talking to me? Long beak ass nigga, boy. Hell no, I'm finna cook your shit. Long beak ass nigga, boy. Pinocchio nose having ass nigga, boy. I really get your ass, boy. I really get your ass, boy. Your ass know you not standing in no suit. I'll see you with the hands. You trying to be me, I'll see- you gotta get past me to be me first. Now, I see you with the hands. Long be having ass. Very focused on what the long-term negatives of that might That's be. That's a nice you chicken. You know, iPad babies will surely just grow out of their three and a half second attention span, right? Well, Yeah, like, why do y'all go in public and act like y'all don't have home training? Bro, you got raised by your parents 18 years of your life. How, as soon as you go out in public, you act like you've been snorting crack your whole life, bro. Act like you got some sense. I hate people who do this, bro. And people do this shit on YouTube too. Like, like I ain't gonna hate on no YouTuber or something. But if I see a nigga like DeAdrian Harding, Canal Joseph, Gideon, I'm running. I swear to God, I will. I'm running with my feet. I'm going to run from them because, 
bro, ain't nobody on that shit, bro. I just want to get home. You know what I'm saying? I don't, I hate troll YouTubers, but then again, they videos be funny and shit, but I be mad if it's me. I'll be the first nigga to fight about that shit. I'm just saying. Then I'm like, bro, y'all can't be in the hood doing that shit. If I go to my local Walmart and try to troll them, I would probably die. I genuinely think I would get shot. Not, but that's not what we're worried about today. We are worried about, once again, the worst TikToks on the internet. Once again, I have gone... Hold on, man. If we talking about the worst TikToks, I don't see her doing anything wrong. She got on a nice little jacket. I like her hair. Hey, I got this LGBTQ flag off, but don't think that mean I'm gay. I get in cheeks. Don't stop it. Stop. Pretty hard to watch. So if you're extra susceptible to cringe, I would recommend maybe you sit this one out. But if you think you have what it takes. My least favorite type of TikTokers are the motherfuckers who think they cute. It might be because I'm ugly that I hate when motherfuckers get on TikTok acting cute. But I hate people who do that. You motherfuckers get on TikTok. You was in the gym for the last two years. Now your shirt off and you flexing. Calling girl like, bro, I hate Vinny. Vinny the hacker. Is that his name? Yeah, bro, I don't like you. I'm just gonna keep it a buck honest, bro, because all the hoes like you. If the hoes like you, I don't like you. I want the hoes to like me. I'm a hater. I do all types of hating. Vinny, I don't even know you, my nigga. But just stop, bro. <laughs> Instead of calling me a snack, just call me a candle. Because I smell good, I'm fired, and I'm part of this whole my you talking about you see what i'm saying bro bro look bro you don't look tough you threatening the world talking about you'll burn it down i'm sorry bro you don't look like you heard a fly i'm sitting out in public and you talking about call me a snack because i'm i'm a i smell good i should be a candle you telling me you got everybody's attention in the place to say that corny ass shit you are not funny you're not funny at all actually i'm just gonna be honest don't call me a snack. I'm a candle. Wow, you really got all our attention to say that. Then after that, you're going to say, yo, burn this whole shit down. I hope they call the cops on you. I hope. Bro, I hope. I hope when I click a minute into this video, you got arrested. I want to see your mugshot, my boy. You got to go. People be really messing with people in public for money. Alrighty, like. off to a wonderful Cook start. It. Now, I've had a lot of people send me this guy's TikTok, and I see why. On a certain level, it's just kind of sad because... And then it's like, you got everybody's attention. Look at that Karen right there. I, bro, this is what I'm saying. I know y'all is not in the places that I'm in. Because if you did some shit like that, I know people in my Walmart who would genuinely, they might get you knocked off. Bro, I walk into my Walmart and I see teens my age literally openly carrying weapons. Me and my mom walk in front of teenagers who are flexing the strap. I think you would genuinely lose your life. Not gonna lie. There's nobody who's not just extremely desperate for attention. This Karen this. wants nobody to call the police so bad. And... Excuse me, sir. Mind answering one quick question for a TikTok interview? Sure. Where do you find the most... Hey, I'll be completely honest with y'all. I used to walk around interviewing people. I did. I used to camp out the mall interviewing people. When I just... I, I ain't gonna lie. I used to, like, do that and then, like... You know how you know how people do in Miami. That was my fault. My first YouTube video on my page is a video like that. And I had to stop. You know why I had to stop? Because pretty privilege is a thing that I don't fucking have, man. I was I was interviewing people and they was just straight up telling me to my face, I would never date you. You are ugly. And I, I had to stop, man. I had to completely stop. I, it's it's literally cut out interview. If I ever get hands on that video, I'm gonna post it. But I, I had to I had to stop, man. It was not working for me, bro. Joy in life. Ooh. Then people who interview people ask them the dumbest questions. Gay son or thought daughter. Yo, yo, would you rather have a gay son or thought daughter, dude? I genuinely think if somebody asks me, do I want to have a gay son or thought daughter, I'm going Shawn Michaels. I'm going. Oh! You know I have my anime. I have a cape on. I have my anime wig right there. I'm looking at it right now. I'm just going to put that motherfucker on and and, and I'm, I'm going to turn full dork on their ass. You know what I'm saying? Question. Let's see Probably. the question. Sure. Yes. Mind answering one quick question for a TikTok interview? Sure. Where do you find the most joy in life? Ooh, good question. Probably with friends and family. Oh my, you shaking that s <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Did bro just get on his knees and start barking? Yeah, you're strange. You're, you're one strange human being, bro. You see a girl twerking and then you start barking. Do you see the strength in his neck that he's putting into that bark? I ain't gonna lie, dog. I'm looking at your hairline right now and that's what caught my attention more. Bro, is that shit a straight line going down? Bro, do you have a barber? Yeah, you ain't. Yeah, this is insane. But what I never realized looking back was that the people doing it were never 12. You know what I mean? Like they were always Yeah, they're like 20. Men, that and, is you know, true. Person, bro, bro, get a fucking job. You are 20. You have a beard growing and you barking. Speed can do that. Speed is not 20. You're 25. Bro, you have to start a family one day. Do you know what digital footprint is? I mean, I can't be talking about digital footprint because I be twerking with a with a with a gay cape on, but still. I mean, but but, but, but still! Everybody, I have an announcement to make! <laughs> Yeah, bro. This is this is bad. Wait, let everybody I have an announcement to make. I'm sorry, but you need to get put on a leash, my nigga. Put, we need to put you on a cage. You are an animal. You have the same mannerisms as an animal. Are you jumping around? Yeah. I have an announcement to make. Ha. Nobody is going to ever in their life laugh at some shit like that. Is this satire? It has to be. As awesome as this video is, sadly it does have its negatives. Now it seems like this guy is kind of the trendsetter for, um, you know, whatever you want to call this. Because just like anything else. And my mom told me, you want to you wanna know what my mom told me? My mom told me from the other room, it sounds like I have autism when I'm making my videos. Which is crazy because I actually am autistic. But like, bro, I think I'm a little bit more concerned for you than the autism you know what I'm saying? I have a cousin who has autism. And if I go out in public with him, I genuinely think he'd be scared of you. You're scaring everybody. The hoes? Come on, man. The hoes just might be watching. Now, if that don't make you lock in, I don't know what will. If the hoes watching, bro, I swear to God I'll lock in. No one actually cares what you do. Watch this. I can literally go right into this target and just be an absolute menace. Guys, yeah, dude, you let's be a fucking me? menace. <laughs> <laughs> right, what did you go say? right into this target and just be an absolute menace. Guys, don't you want to high five me? <laughs> I can literally scream random dates at people and no one cares. January 14th, 2023. March 7th, 2023, at 11 p.m. Please come to the hood. Please, let me, look. Anybody who thinks they're brave enough to do that, just come to me to my local Walmart. Then we'll see if, if y'all can do that at my local Walmart, I'll respect y'all. I genuinely think y'all would get smoked. It's always, it's always the people in the burbs. Hey, those were the worst TikToks ever made. If you want me to react to any type of TikToks, guess how many likes I need on this? I'm blue balling you. You like that? 3,000 likes and we gonna do that. I'm about to go make part four of you guys' favorite series. What series is that? Yes, sir. Shout out to everybody with the like on the like. like, 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 like. One, two, three. You know what I'm saying? They hit the like on the last video. They love me. They love me. I love y'all too, no cap. I swear to God, I'm dying for y'all. I met a supporter in Target. Next time I meet a supporter, I'm telling them, I'm dying for you, straight up. I, I'm jumping off a cliff. You know what I'm saying? Straight for you. But hey, I'll see you guys in the next video. It's your boy Dooley, and guess what that means? I am out. I like this.